In this exercise, you will key out a green screen element using the master keyer and composite it on a high resolution background in the timeline. We will use the top layer on the timeline to composite the green screen clip and the bottom layer for the background element. Continue to work with the timeline from the previous exercise. Make sure to disable the ripple and trim options to avoid changing the timeline duration and select the Snap Closest option. Navigate to the beginning of the timeline. If you follow the exercise order, you should have two video layers by now. If not, press the Layer Plus button to add a new layer on top. We need a green screen element to go on the top layer. Select the first shot, 01 and Transfront on the timeline. To copy the green screen clip, hold C and drag the shot straight up to the top layer. Now we will replace the bottom layer with the backplate image. Select the clip on the bottom layer of the timeline. Expand the source folder Compositing Entrance to see its content. Select the Entrance backplate image. This is a high-resolution image. Press the Replace button located between the two players. This replaces the clip in the timeline with the one in the source area. The one-frame background is stretched to fill the duration of the foreground, and a soft resize is automatically applied to fit the timeline resolution. To frame the high-resolution image inside the player, we're going to change the resize option. Drag the focus point down to display the bottom layer in the record player. Select the backplate segment. Click on the resize effect to display its controls. Change the resize option from center crop to letterbox. In the next step of this exercise, you will create a mat for the green screen element with the master keyer.